What's up guys, I just got my uh, MGT 8.0 in the mail from Tower Hobbies. Uh, this is my second go at this video here, because first one had some technical difficulties, but got a big bag of goodies here too with it. Let's see what I got here. I got the Habaco after run oil, keep my motor good. Uh, some D-cell batteries for when I'm not around the girlfriend, you know, she might need these. <laughs> no, they're for my uh, glow plug igniter. Uh, this is my uh, 1600 milliamp 5 cell pump pack. It's from our receiver. Some uh, tire adhesive, you know, some backup stuff. I'm going to shred it in up in the, up in the uh, grass and all. <clears throat> I got some uh, team associated filter treatment. Keep the air filter nice and clean. I got a cool MIP on board temp gauge so I could tune this beast up pretty good. Pretty cool. Um, let's see, 1800 milliamp pack for the, uh, the Pro Start. Some Venom 2400 milliamp rechargeables for the transmitter. <clears throat> got a team associated charger for the transmitter. And receiver. I think that's all the accessories. Got you know the catalogs, receipts, and all. Tell you what, guys, Tower Hobbies was uh, pretty much on point. Couldn't find a better deal, so I recommend them. Um, here's the main piece right there. MGT 8.0 still in the box. Pretty excited. Uh, it's my first RC truck in like 18 years. My first one was a Clodbuster, which I'm selling right now on eBay. So I figured sell that beast and get something new, nitro powered, be pretty cool. Um, yeah, so I'm not gonna unbox it right now because I'm actually getting ready for work. So I might make another video, but I'll just give you guys a quick, a quick look at it. I feel like opening up the box and doing all that. So let's see. I'm sure you guys seen this before, but anybody. Who wants to check out, you know, I don't know if they made any differences on the box or anything for the newest newest one, but this one just came in. It's pretty pretty uh crisp box box here. I went with the MGT because <clears throat> I was thinking about the, getting the 5.9 Savage, but just watching the videos online and stuff, this thing was looked like pretty much the best beast out there. I've got some uh some hop-up parts already ordered for it. So should be pretty badass. Alright, so I'm not going to open it up right now, but I'll make another video later and get this thing cracking. Alright guys, talk to you later.